is a family man who is faithful to his lovely wife Barbara of 33 years and loyal to his friends. Don Rickles, I am a major, major fan. I think you are one of the most fabulous guys in Hollywood. And I know a lot of guys in Hollywood. I know you do. And I thank you. And I feel the same about you. You are a very, very warm, outgoing person. Thank you very much. Yes, you are. Not only do I enjoy your comedy, but I think you are a tremendously fine actor. Well, thank you. And I think that's not something people know. I remember <laughs> seeing you on television in a very early Debbie Reynolds, Tony Curtis movie, and I that's went, right. that's Don. That's right. And you hardly look any different today. Well, that's very sweet. Thank if you. If you had a, a choice in life, I mean, your comedy has always come first. Would your acting have come first, perhaps? No, I believe it or not. A lot of people don't know, but when I came out of the service, I went to the... American Academy of Dramatic Arts, and I passed really? the audition, and with my image, nobody, they get, they get a little stunned when they hear that. Yeah. And uh, I was, I, would, I went two years, which is the course, and graduated. But I was always good at the stand-up kind of thing with being the sarcastic guy that I am, and created this image. And so I always say, you stay with what got you to the dance, mm -hmm. and uh, the stand-up stuff is what really paid the rent and really uh, kept me going. And so acting was always a bonus. I was dying to know just what it was like for Don to work with the great Robert De Niro in the movie Casino. He was annoying. <laughs> you, know, you know, Bob was very nice, you know, but he's a very dedicated actor. Mm -hmm. So it's Scorsese. That was quite an experience for me to be part of that cast, Casino, with Pesci, Casino, and of course Sharon Stone, who was very beautiful and wants to be with me. She wants to be with you? Yeah, you know. I, you know. She loves I'm you. married 33 years, so where am I going with her? You know? So what did you do? You turned Sharon No, I just down. told her to wait in the car. <laughs> She's still there. But uh, it was a great experience. And, you know, mm. when you get, get an opportunity like that. Now, you've been married a long time. How many years have you been married? 33. 33 years yeah. to the beautiful Barbara, who's well, a wonderful you. woman. Yes, and everybody you. in town adores her. Well, thank you. But you have been in show business all that time. And we all know what goes on in show business. Yes. And that is women throwing themselves well, at you. <laughs> look at me. They don't throw themselves <laughs> at me. They get in shots so they don't catch it. But, uh, no, what's happened with me, uh, I, in my young days, uh, every time you worked on the road with the singer, you fell in love with the singer. So every singer I worked with, I was in love with for 10 minutes. And then I met Barbara, who I, who I to this day call a Valium. I mean, well, I was a basket case, always high energy, and blah, blah, blah. And she's the type of person you say, Barbara, I just did a great show with Frank Sinatra. And she'll say, Mr. God. <laughs> it's interesting. So tell me some of the singers you fell in love with on the road. <laughs> they're all 90 now. And <laughs> They're, they're you don't want to talk the, about it? They're singing at the but, state but farm. But you, you, you know, you're, you're in Vegas all the time. Mm. All those beautiful showgirls, those beautiful no, ambitious... Those, uh, I, hey, those days are over for me. I'm, I'm, I'm interested in getting through the show and getting back to the couch in my suite. So uh, <laughs> as far as women are concerned, I'm a very happily married man with two children. And uh, I had my, my day in the sun, so to speak, running around. And uh, we have a great relationship, my wife and I. We travel, as you do with your, your fiancé, and yeah. we love to go to Europe and what have you. We have great trips, and so we enjoy each other. So I never have an eye for a woman except my wife. Don told me another important person in his life was Frank Sinatra. Don credits the singer with supporting him throughout his career. You bought something special today. This is a wonderful picture of you and Sinatra, and uh, it looks like you liked him a lot. Yeah, I, uh, I don't want to get carried away, but I, I do. Uh, he's been my mentor and uh, my first boosters, and I've always admired uh, and looked up to him as, a, as, a, as an artist and as a person. Now, I understand that you're going off on the road with the fabulous Joan Rivers. Yes, I'm, we're, we're delighted. Uh, uh, Joan and I have worked together last summer. We toured all around the United States, and yeah. now we're doing it again, and we have a great rapport with each other. And She's a wonderful comedian and a good person, and I'm delighted to be associated with her. So if people wanted to find you, where would they go? They'd go in the phone book and look it up. <laughs> where do I find me? they go out on the highway and say, anybody see Rickles and Rivers? <laughs> My darling, I know you're going to be a grandpa soon. Uh, You've got yeah, a beautiful you. daughter, and I think that's going right. to be just oh, fantastic. You so You'll be yeah. the best yeah. grandpa. Yeah. Thank, oh, you. thank you. Thank you. Thank you. You're so you were funny. Great. You were great. You were great. You were thank great. You. Thank you, Don Rickles. You really are a softie. I told you, everyone.